Lawyers for a former Fort Worth police officer charged with murder are asking for a new judge. Lawyers for Aaron Dean say Judge David Hagerman is biased against the defense. Dean is charged for the 2019 shooting death of a Tatiana Jefferson. Fox 4's Dion Anglin joins us now with more. Dion. Hi there, Heather. 11 witnesses. That is how many people Aaron Dean's attorneys called to testify. All of them say that Judge David Hagerman, they have observed, uh, show uh, or display an unfair bias toward Dean's defense team. Aaron Dean entered the courtroom without expression. His attorneys set to argue their claim that Judge David Hagerman is biased and prejudicial against them. They want him removed from the murder case. With a different judge on the bench to decide the matter, no cameras are allowed in court. Dean's attorney called several criminal defense attorneys as witnesses. Some had observed Judge Hagerman at a June 3rd pretrial hearing on scheduling conflicts. Wait a minute. I grant you your motion for continuance, and now you're complaining about me granting your motion for continuance? The defense asked one attorney, Harmony Shearman, what did you observe about the interaction between Judge Hagerman and myself? Shearman, the judge seemed angry with you. The defense, how was his anger expressed? Shearman, in many ways, verbally and visually, you could just tell he was very angry, and I felt he was being disrespectful toward the defense. On cross-examination, the prosecutor asked Shearman, Judge Hegerman can be rude to everyone, can't he? Shearman, he can. Prosecutor, are you familiar with how many trial settings there have been for this case? Shearman, no. The prosecutor, would you agree a motion to recuse a judge is a tactic in and of itself to delay cases? It puts a stop down on it, right? Shearman, yes. Dean has been out on bond since he was arrested for the murder of 28-year-old Tatiana Jefferson in October 2019. Thursday, a show of community support outside the courthouse and inside. Some who wore T-shirts with Jefferson's name and image were told to turn them inside out to be allowed in court. It triggered frustration. And so we're going to comply because this family has been through enough s already. Now, the defense wrapped its case uh, late this afternoon. The, the state put on its case without any witnesses. And the visiting judge, Justice Lee Gabriel of the Second Court of Appeals, she's taken all of the evidence under advisement and says it's likely she'll issue a ruling in this matter next week.